I wonder whether you feel the same as me. I wonder whether those years that you spent here when you're teens are perhaps the best remembered part of your lives. Mine was. Uh, I will never forget coming to this place for the first time. Uh, it was a remarkable time. It was in the 45. Uh, and that was very strange because it was just peace. And undergraduates here sitting where you are included some who had been deferred from when they had due to come up in order to go and fight. And they were there with one arm or one leg or other crippling injuries. And I, as a 60, 18 year old, realized how lucky I was. But of course, I was more lucky than that. Because when you're 18, if you remember, suddenly when you come to Cambridge and new windows open, you see things you had never heard of before. You hear things you'd never heard of before. You hear madrigals, as we've just done, under King's Bridge, I remember. In my own discipline, uh, natural sciences, I came to study geology and paleontology and fossils. And I saw fossils I'd never seen before. And I had learned of animals I'd never heard of before. And I heard things of all kinds I'd never heard of before. These were memorable memorable years. I was in Memorial Court, as I explained, and we lived, of course, in, in modern comfort compared with what people did here. But this was the heart of the college, and we came from Memorial Court across that fabulous bridge and along that marvelous avenue. And this is where Claire Hart beat loudest. And this is where I heard all those new things and made new friends, where I began to realize that the world was a much bigger place than I really understood until then. But there was another reason for coming to Old Court, because it put you in touch with the past. It put you in touch with those generous people who had created this institution. And Claire wouldn't be the same if it hadn't have a link with the past in the way it does. Of course, uh, there were problems of living in Old Court, uh, as we all know, I mean, no sanitation. And, and in 1945, it was really quite hard going. But nonetheless, it was a fabulous place, a marvelous place. But in order that it should be remain so, things have to be done. And thanks to so many of you here, things are being done. It is marvelous to think that 18 year olds are going to come up and thanks to you and all you've done, they will come up with that wonderful feeling of opening new windows and seeing the world and life and understanding friendship and scholarship. All those things we value so highly which are born here and nourished here and which you'll never forget. And to all of you who've done so much for this appeal, I thank you on behalf of 18-year-olds as you were and as I was and as will be coming over the next decades. They will all be very, very grateful to you for all you've done. Thank you very much.